I'm Desiree, an herbalist in St. Petersburg, Florida, here to talk with you today about salt in aromatherapy. Bath salts come in a variety of soothing fragrances and they are great for soothing pain, healing the skin, helping with circulation, and clearing toxins. I've got a great bath salt recipe for you today. All right, for our bath salt recipe, we're gonna start off with a half a cup of borax. Borax you can find in many aromatherapy products as desert salt. Next, we're gonna do one cup of Epsom salt and a quarter cup of coarse sea salt. Two tablespoons of baking soda, and this is often found in products as soda ash. Two tablespoons of white cosmetic clay. And then you can pick your dried herb of choice. I've chosen rosemary. Rosemary is great for oily skin. You can chop it up in a blender or you can just break it up by hand. If it's dried, it, it easily breaks into pieces. And then to add to the effect and the soothing fragrance, I've chosen lavender essential oil. I'm going to add just a few drops. And it's best to stir the um, bath salts with a whisk to incorporate the fragrance evenly and break up any um, clumps that you might have in the salts. Lavender and rosemary are a great combination. They have very healing properties and very soothing, calming properties. Once you've got your salt mix blended thoroughly, if you're using essential oils, you want to cover it with a towel and let it sit for an hour or two to let the scent blend into the salts. After the bath salts have had an opportunity to sit and absorb the scent of the essential oil, you'll want to package it in a sealable container, preferably a glass jar. Mason jars work great. If you're giving it as a gift, you can get really creative and put pretty labels and ribbons uh, around the jar and it's a wonderful gift. It's very healing and uh, soothing for yourself or your friends. I'm Desiree and this is Salt for Aromatherapy.